Hi everyone, I'm Ken Resnick, your host for Rampage LPWA Style. And on this video, you'll be seeing some of the most popular stars in all the LPWA in some of their roughest and toughest matches. You'll see the likes of Heidi Lee Morgan, the champion Susan Sexton, the beautiful, magnificent Mimi, the ever popular Terry Power, and to start things off, Malia Hasaka goes up against the veteran Leilani Kai. Fans, this bout is scheduled for one fall with a 10-minute time limit. Introducing first, from Honolulu, Hawaii, weighing 179 pounds, Leilani Kai! And her opponent this evening, from Osaka, Japan, weighing 110 pounds, Malaya Hosaka! Well, she is small, but dynamite comes in small packages, Jim no, Cornette. Le and there, there's a perfect example. Leilani Kai is not that small. No, I'm talking about Hosaka, and look at this. She comes out like a stick of dynamite. Leilani turns it around, and look at that move by Hosaka. There's a drop kick, and Leilani Kai is down, and I think she's confused. There she goes. Beautiful move by Hosaka. She goes down. This lady has been compared in the ladies' circles to someone you're very familiar with, and that being, of course, the great Muta, the ladies' circles. This woman is compared to, and the people look at her, and they see the same type of moves. She's from Japan, and she does those Japanese-style wrestling. Well, I'll tell you something. If you want to talk about Japan, then talk about Leilani Kai, because she has been on more tours of Japan than any other American lady wrestler. She and Judy Hart have been to Japan 21 times and won championships there. So if you want to talk about Japan, talk about yeah. Leilani Kai. Right. And by the way, you know what happens to a stick of dynamite in the end? It gets blown to bits. <laughs> there you go. All right, let's talk about Leilani Kai. Right now, she's on the mat, and she's got her leg back. She had her leg being worked on a mistake there, a mental mistake by Osaka. Lalani Kai, part of the Glamour Girls. And Jim Cornette, I'm going to make a statement. I think they've lost their focus. I, here we see them wrestling in single matches. Let's be honest, their record over the past couple of months of the LPWA has been average. It's been adequate. But the Glamour Girls are former champions. She's got her down. One, two. Osaka kicks out. But as well, I was saying, I think the Glamour Girls may have lost their focus. And I don't think we're seeing the best of the Glamour Girls that we've seen. I see what you're saying, but you see Leilani Kai and Judy Martin still two count there. Still very capable wrestlers. And let's not forget the Glamour Girls were in the finals of the LPWA Women's Tournament. Look at that! You've seen that move before, now she? And she almost uses it to put it into this match. And you've got to be very familiar with a move like that. She's using speed and quickness against Leilani Kai's larger size and more vast experience. But the problem is, like I said, the Glamour Girls finalists in the LPWA Women's Tag Tournament. Team America ended up with the belts, but it was on a referee's decision. The Glamour Girls have been champions of other countries, been champions many different times. All they need is a catalyst. They need something to propel them, to focus them back toward the tag team title. If they come up with that one focus, then I think they'll be champions. Look at this move. She might be out of this match right here. No. She kicks out the power of Leilani Kai, but you've got to admit that was a beautiful move on the part of Malaya Hosaka. Again, she's having to use that quickness and that speed to offset the size and power of Leilani Kai. She has so far been very good at it, but now look at this. Leilani Kai stepping in the fingers of Malaya Hosaka. <laughs> I kind of like that. Malia Hosaka, no doubt about it. She's had some fine maneuvers so far in this match, but you see, that is the way that you beat an opponent. That's the way you wear somebody down. It's not necessarily flipping and flying through the air. It's grinding the wheels on the top rope. It's putting the beat into their chest. That's the way you wear somebody down. That's the way you win a wrestling match. Now, these fancy moves may catch somebody by surprise, but Leilani Kai is the only man in her hand. No, 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 no. What's she doing, kissing it? She well, she may have been. Her hand. Now, don't get argumentative, Joe. You'll hurt my feelings. She may have been kissing for all we know. Her hair was covered up. We don't know what she was doing. Well, is she choking her now? She's got her throat draped across the rope. She used the referee's five count once again. That's what I'm saying. Leilani Kai has the experience. She's the veteran here. Malia Hosaka has a few wrestling lessons to learn in this match, and I think that she's going to learn her well because they're going to get drummed into her head. 
Kalea Hosaka has the moves that will be necessary to win a match like this. She is against one of the wiliest of veterans in the Lani Kai. As you said, more tours than any other American lady wrestler in Japan. So she's very familiar with the Japanese style. And I think that that is what has given her the advantage here, is she has known what to expect from Malaya Hosaka. Oh, oh, all of that weight. All oh, right, right. Now, right. right again. I mean, all of that weight across the stomach. Joe, 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 let, let, let's not talk about somebody's weight, shall we? After all, this is a lady. And by the way, when you back up, you make a beeping noise, and don't you? That's what I want to know. Can we just keep the comments to what's going on in the room, Jim? And right now, a sucker. Oh, my God. Osaka. I'll tell you something, those moves you can win a wrestling match with, those spin kicks you can win a wrestling match with, but that experience by Leilani Kai, that told the tale right there. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the bout, Leilani Kai. A mistake on the part of Malay Osaka, taken advantage by Leilani Kai. She wins the match. Certainly some tough luck for Malia Hosaka. Had it not been for that missed dropkick, she could have certainly scored a very impressive upset indeed.